<laughs> I'm not actually wearing glasses. Hey guys, um, this video is meant to be taken as a joke, so, you know, please don't flame me. You have already roleplayed. NANI?! That's right! Without even realizing, without even trying, you have roleplayed. You could even be roleplaying right now, and not even realize it. I can hear you say already, But sass! I don't roleplay! I'm not a cringy weirdo! And to that I have to say, ah! Allow me to explain. Roleplay is... it's just a word. It's a big ol' umbrella term used to describe the different ways we live out our characters' lives in the game. And I can pinpoint the very beginning of your depraved adventure into roleplay. The character creation screen. In this fantasy game sprinkled with races ranging from beasts to bimbos to literal potatoes. Unless you create a here that looks exactly, and I mean exactly, like you, then congrats buddy. You've already joined us. But let's say you've crafted your player character to look exactly like yourself. But wait, this is a Square Enix game, which means everyone's impossibly pretty. Uh, and I mean exactly! Let's go over a quick checklist. And for every instance of roleplay, there shall be a paddling. Creating a character with a special physical appearance for you to use. That's a paddling. Using a name that's not yours? That's a paddling. Two strikes, we haven't even loaded the actual game yet. Don your RP tag now, folks. All right, all right. These are cheap shot, low blow examples. You see this? Yeah, this thing. Yeah, right here. Of course you do. Word on the street is they call them glamour prisms. They can make your fancy raid gear look like a thong and boots if that gets your pencil sharp. Ever use one of these? Ooh, you better believe that's a bad one. But let's just say that your gear is totally fine and you can do whatever content you want. But look! Check out this shiny needle weapon that drops from an extreme that you skipped in the past. Are you gonna learn the strats and get the clear so you can possess this sweet ass sword? Or, you know, just bite off the marker board. You know, you know, whatever. Well, I've got some news for you, baby. It's a peddling. Oh, yeah, and do you have one of these macros for your invulns or raises? Believe that's a bad one. And on a different note, this one may actually scratch out a few nerves, but uh, you got a piece of gear you're still holding on to? Something you've outleveled ages ago that holds no real value in today's gaming market and market meta? Maybe it's a piece of raid gear that someone pentamelded for you that was your first time ever, you know, getting something like that and meant something special to you. That's still chilling in your Chocobo saddlebag? That's a bad one. And if you have ever, ever used the RP walk speed, I welcome, friendo. Keep an eye out for me in the party finder so I can drown your newfound self-hatred in imaginary hooch. Get away from me, my man! 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 Get away from me, my man!